Hi, this is Don, and I'm an old school kind of guy. Somebody visited me recently, and they said, Wow, you've got a lot of rocks collected, and you've got all these different varieties in your tanks. I mean, I've got tanks with white rocks, and I've got tanks with black rocks, and I've got tanks with red rocks, and uh, I've got, uh, you know, a few different shades. And I can usually find rocks that are the same shade and same color, same texture, look like they came from the same giant boulder, and put them all in the same tank. I like that. He said, where do you find all of those? And he said, how can you afford them? Because I've actually got multiple five-gallon buckets full of rocks in the back room. And some are pretty big and some are, are this size or smaller. I've even got some river stones. And yeah, you can get big river stones too, you know. So, he said, where do you, do you go out and collect your own? <laughs> he said, hardly. It's hard for me to even walk. Um, but if you're going to go collect your own, you know, make sure you test them in a tank with fish. Um, I would, if I was going to go collect my own rocks, I would put you know just uh, some of them in a 10 gallon tank and throw a few fish in there see how the fish do um, uh, what I do is I go to a landscaping company now I can go in there and I'm buying rocks for three cents a pound some of them four cents a pound and I can go in there and buy three five gallon buckets and pay ten bucks I've never paid more than ten bucks for three five gallon buckets and I probably don't fill them all the way to the top but okay and you know a landscaping company they got a lot of choices of rocks and there you know what you're getting if it says granite it's safe for your tank as long as you clean it well if it says marble, it's again safe if you clean it well. If it says river rock or rip rap or whatever, uh, most of those are going to be safe for your tanks. If you've got Africans and it says limestone or sandstone, well, sandstone uh, dissolves too fast. If it says limestone, why not? You know, depending on your water and, and so forth, uh, your Afri African rift lakes might just love it. If you've got some brackish water, or monos, or scats, or puffers, they might love it. Point is, you can save money, just think. Here's the point. In the old school days, <laughs> we didn't have all the options you got today. Uh, our fish store didn't carry rocks. Well, the only fish store I had near me, within, what, 300 miles? Uh, she didn't carry rocks. So if we wanted rock, we had to go get our own. That's kind of the old school way. But even though I can't do the old school way, I can still do the old school thought process. It's actually cheaper than going out to collect your own when you add in the gas and the time. But hey, you know, going out and getting your own is kind of fun too. And having fun, that's what we're here for, right? Bye.